For Families Drive is happening right now throughout Rochester, and this event is critical for local families in need, especially this time of year. News 8 is a proud sponsor, and that's why we have Adam Chodak live at the tops on Jefferson Road and Henrietta. Adam, give us an update. How's it going out there? It is going so great, John. We've had so many donations come in right here in this location. We talk about all the partners we have in this, Foodlink, WCMF, but one of the ones that I love Mary Therese Friel and her entire team, thank you so much for joining us. Oh, thank you for having us. We look forward to it every year. And you have been here for several years. 13 of them, yeah. That's so impressive. And what do you do? Each time you come out, I know what you do, but what do you talk about? What you do and why you do it? Well, it's an annual tradition. The Mary Therese Friel Modeling Agency, along with Polano and Faro, and their group that's here with us, too. We collect all year round, but especially a big push right toward the holiday. And we just collect food upon food upon food and want to give it to our community that's in need terribly. I mean, we encourage everyone to help us. And I have to be honest, I did an interview with you just a few weeks ago, and you give so much more even beyond Food for Families. What drives that? Uh, we just of our community, I think it's really important that you, we all have more than we need, and there are so many who don't have enough, and we can all help. And it doesn't take a lot to, when you pick up one can of food, pick up a second can, or one box of spaghetti, pick up a second box. So the important thing is, and to partner with great folks like Langston and his group from Polano and Farrow, and, and, and grow the event. That's really important. Every year we get bigger. Yeah, we can great. get more. Awesome. Thank you so much, Thanks Mary. Thanks for having us. Uh, she is a powerhouse, by the way. Go to Adam Interviews. Check out my interview with her. Just an amazing life, and she continues to give back, given all that she has received. By the way, if you do want to give actual food, you don't want to come in and buy a brown bag of hope, or it's too late, you can't get out, these are what they're looking for. Peanut butter, canned soup, tuna, vegetables, fruits, soups, and stews, rice, 100% fruit juice, macaroni and cheese, jelly, and jams. But again, they'll take almost anything as long as it's acceptable to Foodlink, and all of that goes right out to the community. They always accept cash, $1, three meals. John, it goes such a long way this time of year. Absolutely. Great job. Keep working it, and we'll check.